Hello, everybody. Welcome to your Indie Peak of Dino System. Uh, this is, as it says in development, alpha version. This is early access. Uh, it's different. Let's uh, let's start a new game. Yeah, we'll go with survival thing. We'll just leave all that alone. All right. So then we get this settings menu after a, a long enough load screen. Uh, all kinds of things you can turn on. So we're going to go ahead and leave it all as is. Um, actually, um, let's go with it. All right. So then we get to uh, work on our dude. So we have 100 points here that we can distribute amongst his various things. So like body muscle, we can increase body muscle like whoa, if we wanted to. Which we don't. You can only be a male in this particular uh, in this particular game. Uh, we'll leave that stuff alone. So we can increase athletics, endurance, resilience, crafting, fire making, uh, melee. Let's do that. And zoology. I don't know what zoology does. Let's uh, increase our gathering, our fishing, and our butchering. Because why not? Um, actually, let's make ourselves a little bit stronger. Can we go up? Yeah, we can go up a couple. And then... There. Cool. Let's start. All right, so here's our little dude. This is a 2D game. Woo, we can spin around. There you go. And you can kind of walk around. So I'm getting soaked because I'm walking in water. We have this little tutorial thing up here. Let's see if I can remember how to kill it. Woo, tree thing. Uh, oh, yeah. Escape. Settings. Disable that. Done. Resume. All right. So I can walk up to the stuff like this fruit here. Whoops. Grab the fruit. Eat the fruit. Nom, 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 nom. I'm dry again. Good for me. So this is a game about survival. You are you are living your survival-y life. Eh, I need you. In my, oh, come on, there we go. Uh, in, you live in your little survival life in a world of dinosaurs. That is a that is a large dinosaur. So you have your usual survival things down in the corner. It's how what the temperature is, your health, your stamina, your hunger, and your hydration. That is a monster dinosaur that might kill me. Let's avoid him. By going this way. All right. I just stepped in dino dung, but hey, whatever. I will eat the fruit. Nom, nom, nom. All right. So this here also says how full you are. So you can you can eat too much to the point where you can't eat or drink anymore, even though you're you're starving or thirsty or whatever. Conifa. Excuse me, little dudes. Just walking by. Ah, stick. Good. So it has a full day-night cycle. We're going to drop our stick there. Oop, pick that up. Put that there. We got a branch. Oops. Let's go in here. They also uh, created so that you could, you can walk backwards if you so desire. But something important to note is if you walk backwards, you uh, will potentially trip and fall. You can stumble walking backwards. So it prevents that attacking style of, um, well, most games of this style and put that in that hand. All right. So we can only carry so much, obviously, because we're human. We don't have a backpack. We're not some big, like, well, mm, I was going to say Morrowind, but Morrowind's not really. Oh, it's sleeping. It's sleeping on my you're sleeping on the stuff I brought. Why are you sleeping on the things I brought? Wait, did I put it under this tree, maybe? No. Dino, you're sleeping on my rock. You jerk. Uh, all right. Uh, so, uh, we can do stuff like uh, right click on herself and drink the rain. Mm, drink the rain. <laughs> Not that it does much for us, but hey. It's it's a thing, right? We can drink the ring. 
Um, maybe these guys will have moved off my... Uh, I'm shivering. There's nothing under this tree. Not much. Now these, these guys will leave you alone, but they can still be annoyed by your presence or what you're doing. So you could be killed by a by a plant eater because of that. Ah! No, wait. That's stuff I put down last time. That's stuff I just put down. Ah, there it is. There it is. There it is. He left it after he got up off his fat butt. Okay. I want... I want you. Fat and. I want you. Fat and. Thank you. All right. So obvious things like high humidity means... Well, I can't start a fire because, well, you can't start a fire when the humidity is high. Um, and it's raining. You can't start a fire. I mean, these are these are things that we as humans turn off. That's part uh, me at uh, that. We as normal, everyday run of the mill humans know. But we have to remember that in most games that we play, honestly, uh, we don't we, we can just like be magical Blah. oops we might be sick um, that's not good so yeah you can you can get sick from doing stuff like that I'm gonna drink from the water mm. that was good that was good so let's hover over this and interact with it. In shade, humid, warm, 89%. So I can interact with it and eat it. Mmm, that was tasty. Ah, another stick. That's kind of what I'm looking for, honestly. Sticks everywhere. Because I need to start a fire when it stops raining all over the place. Also, you can craft things, though, to be honest, it's not easy. I mean, none of this is really easy, but... You need two sharp stones. You need some sharp stones to create simple stuff like axes. And I have taken a long amount of time to try to. Uh, I lost. Where is my. Where do you think I put. I'm lost. Well, that's an allosaur. Okay. I've been completely lost now. Where in the world was I? It's cold. I'm shivering to death. Um, I should take a nap. Yeah, I know. But I'm trying to find the house. The his ass. Not so much that we have a house. I'm like walking dino droppings. Ah, sleepy triceratops. Okay, we're in the right spot. Um, it's nothing is, comes easy to you. Um, stuff like just oh good we found our we found our spot cool. drop that stuff now I can sleep now you don't just immediately fall asleep you get tired over time based on the environment and your own need for sleep so when you're really tired you fall asleep fast when you're not tired you don't fall asleep very fast additionally in the daytime you're going to have problems falling asleep. When you're freezing cold, you're going to have trouble falling asleep. And light a fire with what? Of course, hold, hold a stone in each hand. It's that stone. That stone. Okay. Now, can I light fire? It's humid. Of course, it's humid. Okay. <clears throat> there we go. Uh, <laughs> the game is not easy. There is nothing easy about this. Uh, get fruit. Get resin. No luck. Yeah, get resin. Aww. All right. So, so if I were to right click and say craft build. <clears throat> so anything in yellow means I can do it if I have the stuff, but I need one sharp stone. I don't. Yeah. I need a sharp stone. I need tendon, which would probably involve a sharp stone. I need sharp stone. You get the point here. It's this is not an easy game, um, and the 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 perspective can be a little bit disconcerting. Um, this guy now believes in God. Uh, perspective can be a bit disconcerting because you're in this top-down view. But it's an interesting um, 
Interesting take on the game of survival. All right, let's see if I can. Uh, no, I can't. I can't remember how to switch over to God mode. You can switch to God mode where you get to play with the weather and basically try to influence the world. Uh, but that's not really the whole point. The point of the game is to figure out how to survive. I right, it's the fruit. The fruit is bad. We will not take the fruit. We have learned our lesson about the fruit. How are you, fruit? You are not that great. All right. Let's see if we can go bother a dinosaur. Hi, Dino. Hi. 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 Um, that usually means that we have a Triceratops around. Oh, look, there's a Triceratops. Hey, what's up? Ah! <laughs> I'm bleeding. Yeah, I would. Ah, oh, no, it's gonna eat me! Ow. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm going to be dino food. Nope, nope, he's bored now. Can I find a stick to throw at him? It's cold, I'm shivering, I'm dying. It's all good. <laughs> uh, it looks like I'm going to bleed out from my wounds from the uh, Triceratops there. Oh my goodness. Dino system! It's an interesting take on the whole survival world where you are um, you're a human in a world of dinosaurs. I have seen videos of people that have play, play more of this and you can get pretty good at it. It's just I'm not that good of a person. <laughs> It's a different perspective, too. I get confused by this perspective. Whee! All right. Until next time, I've been Derek Tebbers. This has been your Indie Pika Dino System, an interesting take on the concept of a, um, of a survival game. Uh, interesting perspective, interesting concept over... Oh, are you asleep? Oh, it's asleep. Can I punch it? Punch it! <laughs> punch it! <laughs> <laughs> uh, there we go, I died. <laughs> Ooh, enter, switch to God mode. There we go. Uh, there we go. Now we can play with things in a little bit different. Let's make it really rain. And blustery and look at that. Yeah. Now we can now we can really see the world. Let's uh get rid of that. Get rid of that. Settings. All right, so there we go. There's God God mode for you. It's quite a storm going on. Dinosaurs are going to die. Death to the dinosaurs. <laughs> uh, it does allow you to kind of see the whole thing. Like, that is apparently a volcano of doom. Hmm. Cool. All right. Until next time. Game on. Be awesome. And don't get eaten by a triceratops, everybody. Not a triceratops. A tri... Tronosaurus. Oh my goodness. I don't know my dinosaurs. I'm leaving now.